Hello everybody and welcome to the video. Today we're going to be going over one of the uh, notices we got, which this is part of the Summoner's 10 year anniversary. Uh, if you go to the events tab right here, the Summoner's 10 times 10 festival, which is the 10 year anniversary festival, it they, they have a list of things that are going to be happening. So enjoy 10 types of 10th anniversary special festivals, which are going to be happening throughout the year. So all the way till the end of this year, which it, it's crazy. So you see, the first one we got was the Nat 5 Monster Summit event, which you'll log on, and you'll get a Nat 5 of your choice after a certain amount of your days. It'll let you summon multiple of them. Then there's the Witcher event, and then this one, which is the 10 years of uh, Hall of Heroes. So, we're going to this right here. So, greetings from Contos, a special event to celebrate Summoner's Awards 10th anniversary. Every Hall of Heroes from May 2014 to the upcoming Hall of Heroes April 2024. A total of 120 Hall of Heroes will be available for 24 weeks. That's right. And uh, if you miss some of your favorite Hall of Heroes, this is your chance. Every Enter the Hall of Heroes of your choice and get various rewards including uh, Devilmon and LD Scrolls. So let's look at the rest of this. So the event starts March 11th and ends around August 25th. And... Uh, I mean, every single Hall of Heroes. Look at this. Oh my gosh. That is... <laughs> but, um, so step one, it'll show it down here. So, as you you will see with the, the, the Talia, the ch Water Chakram Dancer Hall of Heroes we have right now. But, um, it'll let you go in. You'll click on one of these. And, uh, you'll go for that Hall of Heroes. And there's a big thing I want to talk about with each of these Hall of Heroes. But, we'll get to that in a second. But, um, second, clear the 10th Anniversary Hall of Heroes. So, 10th Anniversary Hall of Heroes consists of 10 floors. Select the autoplay button from the battle preparation screen to play from floor uh, 1 to 10. Every floor requires the same amount of energy. Each floor gives you 25 monster summoning pieces. Floors you already cleared cannot be entered again. You can obtain 250 monster summoning pieces by clearing all 10 floors, which I believe that's like 5. If I'm not mistaken. So you can get five copies, which is pretty good. And then you could run the tenth anniversary Hall of Heroes via repeat battle. Which Okay. So I hope my I hope my math is correct. I don't want to look stupid. But three, gather monster summoning pieces to summon monsters. You need fifty monster summoning pieces to summon the monster. Okay. Yeah, so it's five. So after collecting monster summoning pieces, visit the summon hands, yada yada. You can summon a monster when you have at least 50 monster summoning pieces. And then every week, um, it changes. So March 11th is when it starts, and then it ends March 17th. And immediately afterwards, on March 18th, you'll get the second one. And it goes on and on like this for the next few months until the end of August. Which is interesting. Week 24, you'll see that the fire one is blurred out. Which, I mean, it would be... in new unit right would it be a new unit or do you think that they're going to just have a, a pre-existing unit that has just not been in the hall of heroes yet i wonder but um you get of rewards based on the number of floors you cleared so um i read ahead of it not too long ago and you really only need to clear five floors each time this event happens to get all the rewards i believe so event number one clear at least Five floors of the 10th Anniversary Hall of Heroes and get weekly rewards. So the weekly reward is two mystical scrolls and 300,000 mana. Um, event number two, you get rewards based off of the floors you cleared in total, which there's 120 floors. I mean, if there's 24 weeks of Hall of Heroes, that'd mean if there's 10 floors for every Hall of Heroes, that's 240. You need only 120, which is, means you need half, five. So the rewards you can get is when you clear 10 floors, you get five mystical scrolls. When you get 30 floors, you get another 5 scrolls. At 60 floors, you get a Devilmon. At 90 floors, you get 10 Mystical Scrolls. And at 120, you get an LD scroll. Really good. Now, the big thing about all of this is this is your chance to get so many LDs, right? Um, typically, with Holly Heroes, what you want to do is you want to try to obtain... <laughs> The, the You want to get the monster that is more difficult to get, right? Which, when you look at just the general currency to summon units in this game, you're getting tons of mystical scrolls, which allow you to summon any unit from fire, water, or wind 
attributes. You cannot summon light or dark units from a mystical scroll. That's why you have the LD scrolls. But if you've played the game for any more than a week, you'll know that LD scrolls are much more rare than mystical scrolls. So with those scrolls already being hard to obtain, on top of that, summoning a, a, a four star from it it's already difficult so i think you should play the game however you want if you want to summon on week one the water rocks uh shasa go ahead but in my opinion aim for the ninja aim for the pra um uh, pirate whichever one you don't have whichever one suits your play style which we'll do a video for each and every one of these when they come out but so if you ever need help on that, I'll, I'll give you my opinions on those. But I think it's just throughout all these, pick one that you don't have yet. Um, no matter how good any of the fire or water ones are. I mean, going through all of them, um, I mean, <laughs> the, the, <laughs> look at this. Week 13 is just so stupid. <laughs> Two fusion material <laughs> units. This is yeah, you better pick the light darks, right? Um week 15 it's like maybe again, if you have the light dark like Rock Shasa and Dice Magician ready, then sure go for like the Cannon Girl, I guess. But um you're really wanting to aim for uh for the LDs. But I'm very interested to to see, see this. I mean, every single Holy Hero since the game started 2014 cuz 2014 if I recall is when the game first came out it's just like jesus christ man these are gonna be some good units i can't honestly god i can't wait to make some videos on these <laughs> on these i don't know are you guys excited for them which heroes are you guys gonna summon for i don't know i'll see you guys i guess when we make the hall of heroes video peace out bye